In today's HealthCast, an incredible medical breakthrough. Researchers in Chicago are using stem cells to cure sickle cell disease. A local science medical specialist, Christy Kruger, explains how it works. This bag contains more than just donated stem cells. It contains hope for the one out of every 500 African Americans with sickle cell disease. Most Teacher Felita Sims inherited the disease from her father and worries the disease will take her life like it did his. The oxygen is being sucked out of you, so it stops you from moving or breathing. Sometimes it feels that way. The disease causes red blood cells to become crescent-shaped like a sickle. The distorted cells can't deliver enough oxygen to the body. The result is excruciating pain attacks, organ failure, and more. Now, at the end of the day, people die. Uh, the average length of life of patients with sickle cell disease it, in the United States, it's about 50 years of age. But now there's new hope. Sims is part of a clinical trial in Chicago where normal stem cells from a sibling are transfused into those with the disease. Sims's donor is her sister. The procedure allows the healthy cells to take over and shut down the production of the bad ones. The immune system of the donor is capable of fighting and defeating the immune system of the recipient which we have lowered with the immunosuppressive therapy. She leaving. Camilla Hearns Quinones recently underwent the experimental therapy. I feel like I have a new lease on life. She says she knew it worked after just two months. I was just sitting um, at the dinner table with my family and I said I feel like I feel good I want to Go out, you guys want to go for a run, is, is what I told my husband. You guys want to go for a run? So far, 20 people have had the stem cell transplant in Chicago, and 80% are completely disease-free. Pretty exciting stuff. Now, Chicago is the first site to try this new procedure since it was first tested by the National Institutes of Health. Next, researchers want to find a way to make it work with donors who are not family members. With today's really great Breakthrough HealthCast, I'm Christy Krueger.